Alexander, security teams installed those new state-of-the-art metal detectors this afternoon. Mecca's goal was to have them in place in time for the NCAA basketball tournament, which starts March 23rd. But they'll be in use before then, next weekend, for the Kid Rock concert. Security at the CenturyLink is now the main act. Most of the artists touring today want to make sure that their guests are as safe as we can make them. And this is one step we're going to. There are 50 walk-through metal detectors you'll see at every public entrance. 44 will be fixed in place, while six will be portable. They can move those to the back private entrances, clearing everyone who walks through the doors, not just spectators. Think of airport security. Security will ask you to remove anything metal from your pockets to speed up the process. It's quicker than wanding because you're walking through unless you have something you're not supposed to have. These new metal detectors have 33 areas to target zones where someone may be hiding something, like my microphone transmitter in my waistband. <laughs> These Creighton softball players welcome the added security. Um, I think it adds that sense of security that all the fans know that no one's going to get in and, you know, bring in something they're not supposed to bring in, so I think it's a good measure to have. We would go through and we didn't have, there was no metal detectors, they didn't check our bags or anything, so that's good. And Dixon tells me the metal de detectors will be used at every arena event. He says Mecca is still deciding on whether or not they will be used at conventions. Now Mecca paid a quarter of a million dollars for this new added security. Reporting live, Michelle Bandur, KETV, Newswatch 7.